So when we are talking of the influencers, we have two major categories. One is enterprise environmental factors. Another is organizational process assets. Infer environment, enterprise environmental factors originate from the environment outside of the project and often outside of an under enterprise. Organizational process assets are internal to the organization and they are supposed to help you. So this is very important things which actually influence your organization. Enterprise environmental factors or EEF refer to conditions not under the control of the project. These are the rules you must follow. Usually have no role in, many, in making it or you have no role in controlling it or you cannot change it. Where is an organizational policies, it may be out, so it, these may be outside the, when you're talking of organizational policies, these may be outside organization like government rules, internal, when you are talking of internal uh, policies by organization, which will be again, very important. You have an organizational policies. They are outside the project outside the organization which is governmental rules and they are internal to the organization which are again beyond project like governance so leadership vision mission software use physical location resource availability employees capability all are these are all internal to organization so when you are talking of external international treaties you are talking of inter external uh, political climates, when you are talking of external legalities, financial consideration, commercial databases, international standards and best practices. So this is what enterprise environmental factors are, which are internal and external. Then we have an organizational process assets. They follow the EEF. I mean, they fo organization process assets follow the EEF. You define the organizational process assets looking at the bigger picture within an organization. They are organization assets like resources, systems, historical information, organizational knowledge base, templates, how to hire, how to fire, how to provide the cost reports, how to get the requisition in place. So this is the quality plan, standards, policies, organizational process, procedures, guidelines, performance measures, templates. Again, when you are talking of organizational process assets, not no one size fits all. So these needs to be tailored as per the requirement of the project. If you are in a program, you might need to tailor it more. You might need to define it as per your organ as per your program organization. But you will definitely take a lead or uh, take an impact from the organization. So if your organization does not have a quality plan, you will not able to suddenly start creating a quality deliverables one day. If your organization is not willing to invest in the cost of conformance, you will not able to convince them in terms of your project that yes, this is the cost of conformance that we have to, uh, we have to take up so that our deliverables are quality oriented. So this is your influencers as an EEF and internet, internal as. O